So we're actually here today in the consulate in Edinburgh because we are today launching a Polish language Facebook site for Police Scotland. It's been put together in cooperation with the consul and some of his staff, but mainly with our own Polish speaking officers to give a way for the Polish community in Scotland, and there's 85,000 of them, to access into Police Scotland. So we think it's a really exciting, innovative idea and we're very pleased to be able to uh, launch it here in Edinburgh. My name is Darius Adler, I'm a General uh, Co-Consul Republic of Poland on the base of Edinburgh. This is a very good uh, occasion for the Polish uh, community and uh, the Scottish police to make for the higher level communication between us. Uh, well, it will certainly be very helpful for the Polish community and Police Scotland because uh, although there is more and more Polish people who live here that can fluently speak English and read English and, and write and post on Facebook and other uh, social media in English, there is still quite a large group uh, that, that feel more comfortable using Polish language. Uh, therefore, obviously, that this will be very helpful for them. Well, I think for a start it shows that an organisation as big as Police Scotland is thinking about uh, individual parts of the community and the Polish, uh, the Polish community is growing uh, in Scotland and it's an important part of the fabric of Scotland so uh, it's important that we use all mediums to try and contact them. Uh, we know that uh, the Polish community, Eastern European community in general is very active on social media uh, and pays a lot of attention to what's going on and I think it's important that we get into that game as far as they're concerned. There will be a lot of information that will relate to, to current incidents as well as general information relating to cultural differences, uh, maybe uh, legal, uh, legal issues, uh, raising awareness of Polish community to, to certain aspects of, of living and, and, and working in the, in the UK and in Scotland. Our regulations, uh, I mean between Scottish and the Polish laws, is different. Sometimes uh, we, have, um, we don't know uh, about uh, difficulties and now I think that uh, it would be a very good occasion to explain uh, the differences between our regulations and it would be uh, very good for the Polish community here. The nature of the social media is such that uh, through those Polish people here in Scotland, their families and friends in Poland will also get access to Polish Scotland uh, Facebook and Polish language and therefore they'll be able to read the information. So if it comes to, uh, for example, a uh, missing person appeal or any, uh, any appeal for, for witnesses that may be already in Poland, uh, there will be uh, a good opportunity to reach those people. I hope that our consulate will be participate in this case as well. So you'll be posting on the page yourself? Tifa? Oh, definitely, yes. Yes, definitely, yes. We, we want to look and see how well used this is, how successful it is. I'm sure it will be successful, I'm sure it will be well used, but we want to learn lessons from this before we, before we embark further. But if it's, if it's something that we think is worth doing, we certainly will uh, look at doing that for other uh, languages in the future.